Hey y'all, what's going on? So, in this part, we're just going to focus on one, not only fighting death strokes since I cleared off all the side stuff except the well, except all the Riddler trophies, that's the only thing I haven't done. Uh the the other side mission we have left besides Riddler and the owning the roads, like disarming the roads and stuff, is Penguin, and that's it. The main story as well, so we're just going to focus on facing off Deathstroke right now, and then we're going to go with the story and see if we can face Penguin before the game is officially over. And then we're done with Arkham Knight. Oh, I also wanted to ask y'all, what did you guys get for Christmas or Hanukkah? Grand Avenue. I'm coming for you, Slade. I imagine he's rather aggrieved at your success so far this evening. You'll have to be at your best to beat him. Uh, the only reason why I'm asking is because I was just curious. Uh, so for me, uh, I got some sheets. Mm, what else is there? A Charger jersey, a nice flannel with a hoodie on it. Um, what else was there? A Shrek shirt and also an Indiana Jones Temple of Doom shirt. So those are the things I got for Christmas. Um, what else was there? Body wash, some candy. Beating on him pretty bad from what I can see. Definitely ain't a good night to be a firefighter. The only reason why I got the Charger jersey, so I like the Chargers. So before y'all jump on me like, oh, I thought you were a Patriots fan. Don't worry. I'm My number one team is always going to be the Patriots no matter what we're going through. So yes, I'm a Patriots fan. During my time away as a Patriots fan, um, I was rooting for the Eagles, um, because they had this Deshaun Jackson and their quarterback I really liked as well. People are going to not like who it was during that time, so I won't mention anything, but I liked their quarterback as well during that time. Uh, Brian Dawkins as well. He was a beast. Um, his nickname was Weapon X, like Wolverine from the comics. I liked him. Uh, then I went from the Eagles to Chargers a little bit. Baltimore. Because uh, I liked Baltimore as a kid. Because of Ray Lewis. So that's the other reason. But um, I started listening to other people's opinions of the Patriots. So that's why I was like on and off again. Because my first Super Bowl that I watched was actually Tom Brady playing against Kurt Warner. And the best team on turf, a.k.a. the Rams. So that's when I started becoming a Brady fan because I thought he was pretty cool. So that's the only reason why um, I started liking the Patriots. Um, then I liked uh, Richard Seymour. Uh, Rodney Hawkins, uh, sorry, not Rodney Hawkins, uh, Rodney Harrison, Asante Samuel Sr., um, who else was there, we had Darrell Rivas, uh, Stephon Gilmore, who's now in the Cowboys, who else was there, Ty Law, my favorite corner, I'm sorry, I'll always have him on my number one for my favorite corner of all time, um, who else is there? Dan Ninkovich. I liked him at Edge Rush. He played... I think it was the right side, so he'd always come after the quarterback. Like, if they were left-handed uh, on their blind side. So, liked watching him play and some other players. But anyways, always been a Patriots fan. 
Don't worry, so... Other than that... Albert, not much I can complain about. Bridges. He's not getting off this island. Yes, sir, but please be cautious. Scans indicate that Deathstroke's tank has a 360-degree field of vision. It'll be impossible to catch on a word. You know what every guy who fought with me and walked away has in common, Batman? I got them next time. Is that thing coming with stealth, Batman? Cobra offline. I've got support nearby. I'm sending it in. We're still in operation. Just a matter of time before I find you, Dark Knight. So, before, um, the other thing I'm going to tell you all is I'm also going to change the suit after we face... Sorry, after we go to the... What was the story mission? The studio. Um, where is it? Vanessa Studios. So, right after that, I'm going to change the suit. So, then we'll just go from there. Um, but then, I'll finish the Riddler Trophy which I will also look up for some help so that way it gets uh, it gets done quickly and we can finish the game. And then I can finally finish the rest of the what's the series I'm thinking of. One Ooh shoot. I'm gonna finish Spider-Man 2. Cobra takedown. Holding formation. Um God of War Ragnarok. Sir, and we've three Cobras left in our field. Also focus on finishing all the other games I have left. Oh, shucks. You gotta be kidding me. Okay. Well, I'm officially... When I find you, you, you're dead. Killing my business, Batman. You wish you could compete. You better pray that car's invisible. Initiating scan. Oh my goodness, man, am I getting screwed? Oh. Getting in trouble more than one way. Hang on. I'm not going anywhere. I've got all night to kill you.
We've lost one. Programming Cobra to respond. Two Cobras operational. My drones will weed you out. That thing come with stealth, Batman? Commencing scan. We've lost the Cobra. Maintaining search pattern. I'm gonna take <laughs> Initiating 360 scan. When I find you, you're dead. Killing spider. Batman, you wish you could defeat me. All right, now all we have left is Deathstroke. Uh, his weaknesses are the same as the Arkham Knights. I'm too strong for you. You're a dead man. And that was the end of it. Real simple. Same tank. Same uh, quick ending. And K.O. You cowardly bastard. You caught me off guard. You shouldn't have dropped it. If you were any kind of man, pull the car over and finish this properly. You had your chance. It's over. I'll kill you, Batman. Then you better hope someone puts up the bounty. This very man that we paid before, I'll deliver you for free. Move it, Slade. Huh. You call this a prison? You think it's wise to put me in here with all these lesser warriors? You might not have any prisoners left when you return. Gather round, kiddies. Uncle Slade's got another tale from the trenches. Ask him to tell the one about the mass graves. <laughs> He's a hoot. Thanks. Let's see. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, I know this one. Man. Looks like the war's taking its toll on you, brother. Not as good as you think you are. Death stroke. That's actually the riddle you get on who 
uh, the Riddler hired in case. Actually, sorry. Hang on. Not Scarecrow, but Arkham Knight in case he was uh, defeated. So he was like, you know, hey, Deathstroke, you know, you were the toughest bad guy that Batman ever faced. So I'm going to hire you to go up against him. So that's it. You can tell who he hired. Um, is there anything else left in the GCPD? I don't think so. Uh, what else is there left? My boost attack, gadget skills, gadget tech. Oh, why the heck not? Now we're all good with gadgets. Um, I knew a guy in Hanover. Time to go into the Panissa Studio. make wallets of deadbeat. Dang, only deaths, sorry, only Penguin, Scarecrow, and Riddler that are left. And then the lockup capacity is full. You survived, Batman. Still out of one. Scarecrow's still out there. Uh, as for the progress on all the riddles... I'm super, super, super close to finishing it. Uh, I believe I'm at 99 Riddler trophies and riddles left. Um, there's not much left. Uh, like I said, I only have one left in the Panissa Studios. And then we're done with it. A psychotic doctor who... Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't think there's that much left. So let's just focus on the story. Scarecrow's men would have been only six apart if he had stayed. It's a bat! I'm trying. Oh, shoot, hang on. Whoa. Hang on, bats. Come on. You know you want to face me. There's a fight going on over there. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, sure. Good. Hopefully we start getting people that'll tell us what the heck's going on. What's and going on? Right here? Look so stupid with that St uh, stags. Ooh, hang on. Nice strike. In stags, uh airships cuz I'm telling you man this is driving me crazy oh and for the boss fights with all the tanks and stuff a friend of mine he's actually commenting in all my videos for Batman Arkham Knight he knows way more than I do about the game um, he told me that all you got to do is press up on the D-pad and you can see who, where the enemy tanks are and that makes the game go a whole lot faster. Um, I believe you get it right after, yeah, it's right after you're, you're looking for the, the, the D-tracks or whatever it was, the car with the big tires that uh mission that's where you get it open it really helps so highly highly recommend using that whenever you're in tank 
tank fights when you're on the search for them, such as going up against uh, the Arkham Knight and Slade. It really helps knowing where their positions are. Maybe even during tank fights. What's this? Tim. So, there goes another boy wonder lost to another super villain. <laughs> if it's any consolation, I can't see him matching my incredible work with Jason, can you? Scarecrow will probably just pump him full of fear gas, then slit his little throat. Oh, what a waste. Ah, well, just you and me now, eh, kiddo? The real dynamic duo. There, there, try those eyes. Seriously, when are you gonna learn? Every time you let someone come to pieces, they end up dead. Looking for someone. You should know by now that nowhere is safe. The Mishnah was so eager to betray you earlier, when his daughter's life depended on it. And now, I have your Robin, the caged bird. Fascinating that your fears would drive you to lock your closest ally in a prison cell. Now those same fears will make you do as I say. There's a storage depot in Kingston. Go there, alone. Prepare to take off that mask, or your friends will die. Oh, and if you guys want to talk to me, uh, besides just on YouTube, I do have a Discord. It's in my links on my channel. So that way you guys can recommend any video games you want me to play uh, and upload on the channel. And I'll make sure to do my best to upload them. Uh, the reason why I say that is because I'm a little... I gotta be a little careful on uh, what games I gotta play. Oh, what games I can play. And uh, once I start like getting more money in, I'll make sure to play as many games for y'all as you want. Because doing this for YouTube is really fun. Like, I'm enjoying it. And I hope you guys are as well. Alright, so... Let's see how to do... This says, says one. Hang on. Hopefully I can just read it instead of playing it in the background because otherwise I'm going to get in trouble. So. Okay. So.
Batman? Batman? It's time I went easy on you. This next riddle has been calibrated to offer a challenge comparable to a popular child's game. I call it... Go figure. <laughs> the rules are simple. They hit the switches that match, match colors you see in the order in which you see them. See. Enjoy. 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 Yeah, this one is really hard. Okay. Blue, green, yellow. Hang on. Okay, for this okay, for this puzzle you need it corresponding um blue, green, red, yellow. Okay. Blue green water from here. From 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 Okay, hang on. Yellow. Green. Yellow, green. Wonderful! Now that we've established that you have a functional short-term memory, green, the real blue, test begins. Yellow, green, green, yellow, red, blue, red, yellow, green. Okay. Okay. Is it going to be hard or... Okay, blue. You'll get there eventually, Batman. You oh, never mind. Green, blue. Green, blue, green, blue, green, blue, green, blue. Okay, hang on. Green, blue, yellow, red, blue, red, yellow. You think you've won back? Hallelujah, that was driving me bonkers. Away at your pitiful brain cell supply. All right. I am puzzling you into oblivion. oblivion. Here's your reward. Re -re 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 All I gotta say is, I'm glad I finished it. Because, man, that was a hard one. For me, at least. Uh, hopefully, I'll get better at it. And I will, and I will definitely be leaving a description down for that Simon Says. Because, man, that was hard. And now we have all of the tapes. Oh yeah. I was right there in the first place. So we have her tape.
Sorry about that, people. That was crazy. So, my honest opinion of for the Pattinson Batman suit in Arkham Knight. It's an okay cow, suit. Babe. Personally, I don't think I'll use it that much in too many walkthroughs. I mean, it gives me more of these in the play in the Batman Beyond suit, which I'm not a fan of in Arkham Knight. Uh, personally, just because it's like the, like I said in my review for the game uh, a while back, in Arkham Knight, Batman Beyond's cape comes out when he's uh, just swinging from gargoyle to gargoyle or perch point to perch point. So wherever he's uh, like looking over people. Uh, to make it simpler. And he swings to that place. His cape comes out. Like his. Uh, I guess you could say his glider. But that's the uh, one thing why I don't like it. Other than that. I mean. It's not bad. I still would have preferred if they kept both. The Batman Beyond. From. City. And in. And the night version. Just because it's. Um, what is it? Just because, just because then you could see both differences of the game. Like, one from the past and, and their own version. And that would have been much better. But other than that, I mean, can't complain about the Batman Beyond suit. Uh. I like the 70s Batman suit more, uh, just because that's my, one of my favorite suits. Uh, the Michael Keaton Batman suit as well. Um, Good for you. Let's see if... Yes! Finally! We got this one left, and then we're done. Uh, with the game, and we'll... Finish the game completely after uh, doing some more of the um, Penguin game. Uh, side missions, I mean. But yeah, other than that, 70s Batman suit. I like that just because it, it was really, really good in the Arkham City game. And then what else was there? Can't go wrong with the Michael Keaton Batman suit. I love that one. Uh, Dark Knight suit from the Christian Bale movie. That was a good one. I'm not. He's not wearing hockey pads. That's the reference for that movie. Because Christian Bale says to the one guy, uh, who's a, who's actually a Batman fanatic in the movie. He's like. What's the difference between me and you? I'm not wearing hockey pads. That's what he says. Um, that's my best uh, ba a Bale impression I could do. Um, I watched the first uh, Batman Begins with Christian Bale when I was a kid. And I got hooked with it. Uh, hooked into those movies just because that was one of my favorite Batman movies to watch. Um, then I started liking Michael Keaton and Val Kilmer. Yes, I know all y'all are going to say you don't like Val Kilmer. Uh, well, not all of y'all. Some of y'all will say you don't like Val Kilmer. But it's just my opinion because... Think of this way. Val Kilmer, and hear me out, he represented the character just as good as Michael Keaton's. And here's why. So Michael Keaton and Val Kilmer, they both represented Batman as an intelligent crime fighter who knew martial arts and everything and knew his way with the ladies. Both impressions were good. Which was better than Bale's. Bale's Batman, yes, he 
showed some signs of a detective. Um, I still liked it, no matter what. He showed some signs of martial arts. Um, he had some great lines. Um, just like when he was quoting Rachel and he said, Plus, his Joker was better, too, than uh, Jack Nicholson's. I mean, I don't hate Jack Nicholson. Don't get me wrong. Great actor. Love him. Just watching that movie over and over again, I felt like his character was given too much free reign of the character. Other than that, I would go with Heath Ledger at number one for Joker, then Nicholson, and... That's it. I mean, if we're doing TV shows, it would be Mark Hamill and then Cesar Romero. Uh, the only reason why I know about Cesar Romero is because I'd watch reruns of the Batman um, show from the 60s. And Cesar Romero was on it. And man, that guy was hilarious. And uh, I'll do like a full... Uh, talk about it as much as I can in a video of mine that I'll do with the 1960s and just go over as much facts as I know about that show um, and go from there. But other than that, there's not much to say about that. Um, uh, oh, uh, also want to know what y'all did for Christmas traditions or Hanukkah or anything that you did to spend with your family. Uh, that's another thing. Uh, for me, I just hang out, hung out with my family for breakfast and dinner. For breakfast, we had some like egg casserole with some um, Portuguese sausage. Portuguese sausage was really good, trust me. And cinnamon rolls for breakfast. Ooh. Really good. Dinner, it was steak, potatoes, and a salad. Man, was it good. Um, and then that's about it. But anyways, I hope y'all are having a good one and loving the videos. Uh, don't worry, the next part will come out soon. I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.